Wake up, Sammy! <sighs> Sam. Sam, are you okay? Yeah, I'm alright. What's happening? What's going on? Nothing. You just started freaking out. What's wrong? I don't... Nyla. I saw her, Nyla. Who? Who did you see? Raven. Sam. Sam, you know she's dead. She's gone. I know. It just felt so real. Where's Dante? Is it my shift? No. You still have time. He went scouting. Wanted to see if he could get more food. Okay. Just give me a moment and I'll help. Sam, you don't have to push yourself. Nyla, please. Okay, Sam. Ezra, please tell me you've figured out where we are. I have no idea. And frankly, I have no idea where to begin. Ezra, it's been weeks. You must have something figured out. Oblique and I have been trying, Nyla. But no matter how I compute it, it just doesn't make any sense. This place has flora and fauna, yet feet beneath us... Nothing but metal. Give me your best guess. Best guess, and this is a long shot. We're inside a megastructure, encompassing a star. A star? Like the sun? Like that sun? Not a real sun, mind you. I can give you 40,000 reasons why I know that the sun isn't real. I know it because the emitter's Israeli effect is disproportionate to its suggested size. I know it because its stellar cycle is more symmetrical than that of an actual star. Yeah, okay. I believe you. What about the structure we're currently on? The concept is quite simple, actually. They call it a Dyson Sphere. Back in the 20th century, the physicist Freeman Dyson theorized that by encircling the sun with a large enough structure, you could capture the star's entire energy output. Brass tacks, Ezra. Basically, we're at the bottom of a very large, very hollow bowl. But humanity was never capable of building such structures. No species should be able to. Not even the Covenant. It doesn't matter who built it. What is it for? And, more importantly, how do we get out of it? The best I can figure is that the shield world we chased the hand of truth to led to a slipspace rift. Somehow, we were directed to this Dyson Sphere. The sphere itself has an Earth-like habitable surface, but with no civilization, the only purpose I can think of is a safe haven. Safe haven from what? Exactly. That I don't know. <sighs> Any luck? Just a few more measly scraps. Has the AI come up with anything? As a matter of fact... Don't get him started. The best he can tell, we're in a bunker meant for a doomsday scenario. <sighs> I've had enough of this Dyson Sphere. What's with him? He's agitated. Something spooked him this morning. He claims he heard Raven's voice. This again. He's done this before? He hasn't told you? Obviously not! Jesus, Dante, you need to let me know these things! It's been three weeks, Nyla. Excuse me if I ignore the ramblings of a heartbroken man. We're built to survive, but this has got to be getting to him. What do you expect me to do? I don't know. But unless we do something, we're going to die. I think I know a way out of here. Raven. She's trying to lead us out.
You promised me this would end. And it will. I have boots on the ground. It's not enough. That attack yesterday was devastating. Three dead, a dozen more injured. I came to people for help. And we are here to help, like I said. I have teams investigating this as we speak. For the situation to improve, you need to calm down. If you want to send a message, I got it loud and clear. I've been plagued by the Yearwoods for decades. No longer. So spin it. Spin what? You're a politician, aren't you? Spin this attack in your favor. Flip the narrative. It was a military attack. Meant to steal our supplies. No civilians were harmed. Uh, Christine, I'm like a big ship in this ocean. Sure, I can pretty much go wherever I want, but I don't have the power over the tides. Some things are too big in for me to control. Public opinion is one of them. Doesn't matter. What matters is fear. You use this attack to instill fear in your constituents. I don't understand. Fear is one of the most useful tools any public figure can have. You can mold people with fear, bind them to enclaves. With fear, you can whip people up into a frenzy and have them ostracize what could be potential allies. You can get people scared enough, they'll do damn near anything you want. And what is it we want? Retribution. This is a provoked attack on our government has wrecked the colony. Dozens are dead. And as I speak with the families of our fallen soldiers, I only have one thing to say to these so-called freedom fighters. You are nothing but cowards. Too afraid to fight the full might of Atlas. Hear this, you cowards. We won't back down. Beltonians won't back down. Atlas will not back Decided not to break it this time. You've been busy. So have you. Care to explain yourself? It had to be done. Am I to assume you leaked the information to Declan's previous headquarters as well? Are you going to accuse me all day, or are you going to take a look at what I found? Arrogance doesn't suit you, Malcolm. Show me, and be quick about it. <clears throat> the latch key to the rupture has been claimed by Oni scientists. Luckily for us, they don't seem to know what it is. Then we steal it. Not going to be that easy. I had a way in, but thanks to your theatrics, security is doubled. And the cones I got from Declan are no longer useful. I'm going to need a team. Big ass coming from you. You're already on thin ice as it is. It was him or me, Thane. If you want this bubble to pop, you need to work with me. Fine. Take a squad, and Vanessa too. She'll only slow me down. I'm hoping she'll keep you on track. Besides, Vanessa's one of our best code breakers. No reason not to bring her along. Yeah, very well. And Mal, don't go off road this time. Or I'll have to tighten the leash. Man, I'd love to know what them boys have been drinking to cause them to act like this. It doesn't make sense. Seven dead, all dressed the same, in a secret back room. They'll take forensic days to get an idea of what went down here. And of course, the barman's not talking. Check it. We don't need cooperation. We just need intel. Patch. Patch, are you there? Yes, yes, I hear you. I need you to run a scan, get the CCTV footage. It uh, might be encrypted, but we need to know what happened here. Bloody bar fight that went wrong, as far as I can tell. 
I'm serious, Patch. Run a scan. That's an order. I don't take orders. I barely take suggestions. Why, you little... Patch, if you don't mind, please. We're kind of in a hurry. And if you get the intel for us, we promise to leave you alone. Oh, all right. I already decrypted it for you while we were arguing anyway. It should be on your tech pad. See, gentler approaches do work sometimes, depending on the person, or in this case, the AIs. Yeah, it did, and on Patch, of all AIs. To be fair, I learned that from watching you. Never know when diplomacy will help in a gunfight. It sure didn't help on these guys. Pretty good for a lone gunman. Three soldiers without the use of equipment. Looks like he's the last one standing. Hold on, he's getting into a warthog? Not just any warthog. This is a civvy. Looks like it's outfitted for load bearing. Patch, can you get us a tracker on that? Updating now. Good. Still in use. Looks like we have a lead on the insurrectionists. Let's go tell the others. Thanks. No problem, kid. Are you hurt? N n no Where are your parents? <laughs> hey, hey. It's okay, kid. What, what, what am I going to do without them? You'll be okay. I may not look like it, but I'm not much older than you. A few years back, I lost my parents too. But you got to be strong, okay? How did you get stronger? I made friends. Do you have any? <laughs> I do. A best friend. But I don't know where he is. Let's see if we can find him. Stand by, Sammy. I got more civilians to pick up. I'm Raven, by the way. What's your name? doing it again. Huh? What? Spacing out. Wanna tell me what's going on? Nothing's going on. You've been acting odder than usual lately. Sneaking off to God knows where? I don't like you keeping secrets from me, Pax. I don't keep secrets. I just keep people out of my business. Excuse me for checking on you. Wait, Paige. I, I'm, I'm sorry. I'm being testy. Dr. Song has been calling me in. <laughs> for what? Shrink sessions? 
Oh. Well, we all have a past. Nothing to be ashamed of. What if there is? What if I got things in my past that I should be ashamed of? Then you get through it. Forgive yourself. Were it so easy? Spartans. Yes, Sergeant Major. Your fellow headhunters have a lead near Jaren's outpost. I'm sending you in as backup. Understood. I guess the pass will have to wait. I can feel those eyes boring into my head. You know why I'm upset. It was self-defense, Vanessa. I didn't have a choice. It was unwarranted. You may have Thane fooled, but not me. Declan was raided not even a month ago, and I think it was you. I just can't prove it. And why would I do that? To be her only supplier. To push Declan out of the business. I don't know exactly. When that raid didn't get rid of him, you took it upon yourself to finish it. Thane paid me to do a job. I am completing it. Declan got in my way. End of story. Just know that I'm watching you. Noted. The men are in place. Get ready. I ordered a heavy for this mission. He'll meet up above on this crevice. We might have more trouble than it's worth. It's too early to get this hot. Get rid of the heavy. Stealth mode only. Put that rubbish down. It's a long way down, but if my readings are correct, there is an unknown power source below us. Then that's where we go next. That. We're just here to get the latch key. If he survived, we wouldn't. We're not just here to steal the key. We need a way to get in the slipstate rift. They may have had more information. You didn't factor that to your grandpa, did you? Just hurry. Blasted alarms. They must have heard the gunfire.
They'll tear us to pieces. Vanessa, find us an exit. I found the door panel. I'm working on getting it open. Targets are over there. Get that door closed. Reroute the power now. Yes, ma'am. Stay ah. mobile. We got it. Retreat now. I can only hold it for a few seconds. Door sealed, ma'am. Delver is locked down. Get that elevator functioning. The key should be 11 more levels below us. Right away. Talk to me. Looks like they were studying Covenant weaponry, too. Instead of pondering the UNSC pet projects, we should focus on the job at hand. Hmm. This is new. Red's not your color. I think it suits me. It won't be long before they send reinforcements. Sir, the elevators are ready. Yeah. Ever wonder why we're here? Ah, uh, never mind. I always get the worst assignments. I told you it would come in handy, Mal. Up ahead. I think this is our target. took you long enough. We came as soon as we heard. He didn't mean that. We just arrived a few minutes before you did. Do they have any captives? Any personnel still alive? No. It looks like someone had a grudge against Oni. They could have been used as hostages for negotiations, but they're all dead. That makes our job easier, and their lives much harder. Patch? Here and ready. Cut the lights. Time to roll out the red carpet. Can you hack it? Just need some time. Keep me covered. Fascinating. If I am reading this correctly, Oni has seemed to discover some sort of pocket dimension. And once we have this key, we can open it up from our side. As long as we can make a weapon out of it, I don't care. How long before it's mobile? Yes, just give me a few moments to separate it from the chassis. They unlocked many of the codes, but not all of them. I need some time.
status report. It's the Spartans. They're here! Damn it, Vanessa. You need to hurry. Almost there. Got it. Take the key and get at the Thane. Grab a vehicle from the cruise bay. Not ours. Now move. I'll hold them. No! Audrey's down! She's been hit! I'm going after him. Go! We'll secure the building. Fall back to the Warthogs. Hold it right there. The last thing I want to do is kill you, but it's still an option. Yeah. 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 You killed me once already, Pax. Do you really think you can do it again? M Mal? What happened? Paxton? Paxton! <laughs> 